Cal BHP UK and on the dyno today we have Yamaha's Super Naked, it is the MT-10. This one is the SP version, so it comes with the bits of bling added to it, uh, nothing done to the engine, uh, but this one does have the Akrapovich DCAT system, uh, still running the Lambda sensors, so we are going to run it up on the dyno, see what it's doing, see how that system has affected the, the running of the bike. We know it's going to make it leaner, even leaner than a standard Euro 5 bike, which is very lean to start with anyway. So we know there's going to be lots and lots of scope for improvement. But let's do what we always do. Let's get it run up on the dyno, see what it's doing, and we'll write a tune to make it run perfectly. Yamaha MT-10, the Euro 5 bike, with the full Acura decal system, what did we manage to do with it? Well, 100% uh, throttle, uh, the headline figures went from 152 to 154 brake horsepower. So not really the biggest gain in the world at the very top, which is not really what we'd expect. Uh, the bike was fueling right at the very top, was fueling okay everywhere else, even at wide open throttle. As you can see from the fueling plot, we've had to add quite a lot of fuel to it. This is obviously going to make the delivery smoother and more responsive. But the big gains to be had were between four and a half and seven and a half thousand RPM. You can see probably to about six thousand RPM. There's a gain of nearly seven or eight brake horsepower. So that's going to be a tangible difference when you ride the bike. You're certainly going to feel that. Now, the lower down the uh, acceleration opening you go, the more tangible and the bigger the gains that you see are. So at 50% throttle here, you can see the uh, red plot is now a significant improvement over the standard blue plot. It is smoother, it is more linear, and really all the flat spots have been ironed out of it. Again, from the fueling plot, you can see how much fuel we've actually had to add to this bike. And of course, at 25% throttle, this is where you're gonna see the biggest gains. The uh, red plot is obviously the modified file, and the blue plot is the original bike running the uh, Acra Decat. You can see we've had to add quite a chunk of fuel to it, which we've done, and the curve now wherever you are in the rpm curve you've made quite a lot more power not only that but the throttle response has now lost all its latency and you get an instant response to any uh, movement that you make on the throttle we really do hope you're enjoying what we bring to the channel please do hit the like subscribe and the bell icon it'll keep you notified of any new uh, yamaha content that we are bringing to the channel uh, we do have lots and lots in the pipeline this bike is available on our ECU flasher, so if you're not local to us, it does mean that you can take a route of your own bike, send that file to one of our map writers, and they'll modify it and send it back, taking into account any modifications you've made to your bike.